What is up everybody and welcome back to the squad room where we are opening up the brand new Radiant EV box. I absolutely love this box. I have been itching to open it um, ever since I saw it. I am a huge fan of EV and a Radiant EV is just what I'm looking for. So let's jump right into this box and see what we can pull. I still have not opened a lot of Pokemon Go. So we have um, a lot of cards that we need. Let's uh, let's get into it and uh, see what this has. All right, guys. So right away we got this this code card for Pokemon Go. If you guys play that, um, there are some codes for you. And after opening the initial box, we get a play mat. And if you guys have not seen this play mat, this play mat is awesome looking. It is huge too. And as you can see, I am rocking a uh, an AR-15 uh, build play mat. <laughs> not necessarily a play mat it is actually a, a mat for working on on weapons and stuff like that so you don't damage or scratch anything but this one this mat is awesome that ev i think i'm gonna have to switch it right now all right y'all so as you can see we got the new play mat down it is looking nice it looks amazing with uh obviously the shiny ev and the tree in the background and then the gemstones it looks awesome let's get right into this i have been waiting so long for this so out of all the products i have been waiting for the radiant ev collection box the the longest this box looks amazing and this card looks amazing i would love to have a graded uh, 10 in this card. It looks absolutely awesome. We have eight packs in this collection box And like I said earlier, we have not opened a lot of Pokemon Go. I have a lot of cards to pull We also get this really nice uh, Shiny Eevee pin. I'm really wanting the alternate art Mewtwo as I'm sure a lot of people are But I'm also really wanting the radiant cards the Charizard Venusaur and Blastoise We pulled the Charizard in the last video so let's see if we can get the Venusaur or the Blastoise this time. Ratatata, I got the Bidoof, and we also are looking for another Ditto card. We got one in the last one, but it was a Reverse Hollow, and they are actually going for a little bit of money. And we have a Blastoise Hollow. I think that's the first time we've seen him. They're actually going for about $4, uh, just as is, at least the last time I checked. Now, that could have changed, because that was on release day so we will see but i thought it was cool to to keep a reverse hollow one just because you might not see a lot of those i'm not sure actually um heck that might be one of the most common things but i'm not sure i haven't looked a lot into it i just know the cards that are in it and i am absolutely loving this set i know there's been a lot of mixed reviews and i'm not exactly sure why man another one We've actually had some pretty good luck. We've opened one ETB and got a Charizard and a, a Dragonite V-Star card. So we haven't had terrible luck uh, with this set. One ETB isn't a good sample size to see how uh, well this set is, like how well the, the pull rates are. But are you kidding me? Another Charizard. Oh my gosh. And a Snorlax. <laughs> wow. I cannot believe we just pulled another Charizard. Now, see, I keep seeing Charizards being pulled. However, people are saying it's one of the harder cards to pull. I, I'm, I'm, I don't understand. Am I, uh, am I wrong in that? Because that is our second one. Put that right next to the Eevee Radiant. I would really like to pull some of the other cards. So far, we've only seen that card and the Dragonite V-Star out of this set. I really want to see some more. But anyway, I saw that a lot of people have seen said the pull rates are not good. And that, you know, the set's small and you're going to see a lot of duplicates. But, you know, I'm not... If Shiny Fates was small and you saw a lot of duplicates... And there's the Dragonite V. I actually love this V card. That is a really nice one. I love the art on it. It's much better than the, the regular like CGI look. 
That is such a nice card. I can't even remember what I was saying right before we pulled that Charizard. You pull a lot of the same cards as in like commons and uncommons, but I think that's pretty normal in a, in a, a smaller set especially. But, it, you know, I'm, I don't open for the commons and uncommons, you know, and I'm looking for them hits. And so it really hasn't affected me too much. Now, uh, I'm not sure on the pull rates. The pull rates, I mean, I've pulled two Radiant Charizards and two Dragonite cards. And I think I've had 17 packs after all these are gone. So I, you can, you can. You can take that as it is. I've actually even pulled a um, a hyper rare spark too. So I I'm not sure. I have had nothing but good things from this set so far. And an Articuno Hollow. Let me know, the guys, how you guys are 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 liking the set. If it's um, not treating you so well, or if you're loving it, I would I would love to know. Cause like I said, I've seen a lot of people complain about it, but you know, right now I can't complain really about anything. I'm loving that Charizard card. I mean, I would love to get a Blastoise and a Venusaur one, but having two Charizards is definitely not a bad thing. Got a Pikachu, Squirtle, Charmander, and a Lapras. Now, I haven't seen a lot of the set, you know, 17 packs, um, and haven't seen a lot of the, the, the big hitters, so. That kind of sucks, but again, it's a smaller set, so you know, take it as you as you as you know what you, you want. Got a lure module, Gyarados, Incubator, Slowpoke, Badoof. Got to look for that Ditto, a Palm. Got a Pikachu and a Pikachu. You guys, let me know um, what you think about this. I mean, eight packs, we pulled two cards. Uh, I'm not for sure what to make of it. I did pull the Radiant Charizard, so it's hard for me to complain. But, you know, let me know. I'm not I'm not for sure what to make of it so far. I need to open some more, but there's not a lot of product that I want to open besides Elite Trainer Boxes. I have some other product that I'm saving, but I'm not sure. I want to keep opening, though, because, like I said, I haven't seen a lot of the set. But thanks for hanging out in the squad room, guys. I'll see you in the next Today's one. Be a good day. Yeah. Set your affirmations, aspirations. I got shit to do, the aftermath of preparation. Good.